Hello all. I'm gonna uh, show you here how to play um, a song that Justin Moore put out a couple of years back called Back That Thing Up. Now there's no official chords for it. Uh, and there's there's one cover on YouTube, but that's that's all I've seen. So I'm gonna show you two. Um, I'm gonna show you first what chords are involved, how to play it. And then I'm just going to play along with the record so you get an idea of how to do it. So let me get the stuff to put here on my computer for the different parts of the song. Alright, now, what you've got um, to, begin, to begin with here, you've got the guitar tuned down a half step, all the strings tuned down a half step. Um, the whole record, all of Justin Moore's record is done that way. It's tuned down a half step. And the verse chords are very simple. You've got E, but you're not going all through the E chord. It's just the first, the uh, E string, A string, D string, strum down. Okay? And you've got A, which can either be played as normal A or just. Uh, take your finger off the B string because you're not actually playing that B string. That would make it an A sus. Um, and that would be on strings A, D, and G. A string open, of course, uh, D string closed, and uh, G string closed. So, the two ways of playing it to the verses are just, uh, it's just pretty much down, 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 down. make it sound more like the record, you can play it like this, which is hammering on each chord. Um, that would be like uh, this. Like that. You're just hammering on the chord. You're just, you're not taking your hand completely off, just lifting it up, kind of muting it, if you will. So it's kind of like, uh, like palm muting, but not palm muting. Then at the part of the song where he says, uh, if you're going to work a farm, you've got to learn to drive a truck, he changes that chord. And that becomes then from that last A, he goes into F sharp. Again, this is relative to standard tuning, not relative to the way it's tuned right now in half step. So keep that in mind. It would be just like if you're playing at standard tuning, this is how it would uh, this is how you referenced. So you've got um, F sharp, and it's it's you don't hammer it on. It's just you can go all the way to um, G sharp if you want as well. So it's just um, and that's for that part of the song. And everything else is just fill in. You fill it in as you need to. Um, there might be some parts where you might have to play A for a little bit longer. Okay, and then the last part where it says, uh, we've got a lot to do. Um, open the gate, water the mule. Ain't no time to play today, no rolling in the hay. Uh, this actually references, uh, you're going to play E. You're not hammering this on, it's just E, E, E. F, F sharp, and G. Again, you could go to G sharp, but I think you just uh, going to G in bar form again. Not normal form, bar form. E, F, F sharp, and G. Okay. So I'm going to play along with the record now. And you'll get an idea how it is. How it is. Uh, also, for reference, the... Um, Course strumming pattern because during the verses it's just down, down, down. But through the chorus it's actually uh, down, down, up, down, up, down. The chord change and the same thing for A. So it's again down, down, up, down, up, down. Okay. I'm going to play it here. He 
you don't start at the beginning. You start after you finish this first line here. I know you're scared of that cockadoodle-doo. Yeah. Or any Now. I know Pretty much it. That's, that's it. And sorry if my timing got a little messed up. It's I'm still working on the song myself. But if you're doing it on your own, you can kind of you know get it right. But uh, that's how it should be. That's how it should sound. So just to revise, you got the E. And one thing I should set out in the verses you're playing A sus. You could play A. It keeps it simpler because you don't change chords then. E, but you just don't strum that last string in it. So just okay. so E A verses. Okay. So I'll play just a little bit of it. to the course that uh Okay. And then you've got the bridge. You just gotta kind of feel into that. And then you just go to the F. And that's it. And the, and like I said, you just and then when, when the bushes come back, you just... And all you have to do is make sure you end up on E at the very end. If you end up on E at the very end of the song, you're doing good. So I hope that's been a good explanation of how to play this song. If you have any questions, feel free to uh, leave comments. Again, just to revise. Um, this is done in half-step tuning. Everything I've referenced is referencing off whole step tuning or standard tuning. Thank you.